Oh. I'm gonna go back to my start screen. All right, here we are. Cool. The abnormal mortal. I'm excited. My <laughs> first uh, proper Diablo experience. <laughs> Woo! Well, and the mobile game. <laughs> yeah. I've, uh... Uh, all right. Um, shall we? Uh, if you guys have, have you guys got any clue as to what classes are available in Diablo Immortal? Yeah, yeah. I, I certainly I've got have. no idea. Yeah, Joe, you're probably familiar because they're, they're mostly the Diablo free ones. But uh, Jay, I guess you've not used, you've not played any Diablo games, so you're probably not familiar with them. No. Um, all right. If we jump in. Um, I press tap to play on my screen? Yeah, you, you'll you go straight into the character selection screen, so I'm going to jump in there as well. Um, so, there Same are goal. basically three, three what I would call melee types and three ranged types. So, mm. if we start at the top, you've got the Barbarian, who's probably in your face, AoE, takes a lot of damage, but, you know, does a lot of um, uh, a lot of Close range um, melee based damage. Um, yep. Quite quite powerful character. Um, tank Typical character. Typical tank. Yeah. yeah, it's a tank basically. Yeah. And then the other one that's quite similar is the Crusader. Um, so it's like a big shieldy tank kind of character. More AOE than that of the Barbarian. Um, and more magical type skills as well in comparison to that of the Barbarian. Um, holy war holy mm. warrior. <laughs> Finger along those lines. <laughs> <laughs> yep. The last melee ca melee type character is the monk. So this is kind of like a hybrid DPS support, quite a technical kind of character that's quite fast. Um, a bit okay, more yeah. squishier in comparison to that of the barbarian and the crusader. Is this like the warlock from Destiny? Uh, no, <laughs> I think the warlock is more of a spellcaster. No, um, okay. yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. It's a little bit. It's a little bit gunslinger. Hmm. Yeah, I would say. Okay, cool. Okay, and then onto the ranged. You've got um, what I would call the main sort of single target DPS kind of character, the Demon Hunter. Mm. Um, quite a lot of skills that do um, uh, AoE type type kind of skills, but is more focused on single target damage. So this would be great. We probably want one of these um, as a boss killer as we kind of proceed. Um, so we, you know, we'll, we'll work it out whether we want to play Demon Hunter, uh, who wants to play Demon Hunter or not, or, or I can, I can choose it. Um, uh, and it's quite a fast-moving, quite a squishy, squishy character. So you know, it can die probably quite easily in comparison to the other characters. Yeah, yeah. but it's uh, it's about evasion and agility with mm. this character as well. Uh, got so you got you've got to move around quite a bit with it. Yeah. Um, next one I'll go to is the Wizard. Um, <laughs> so this is the magic-based range character. You know, yeah. as, as squishy as the Demon Hunter, probably more AoE based than single target in comparison to the Demon Hunter. Um, and there's a mix of combos that you could use. It's a bit more technical in comparison to the Demon Hunter. It's a bit of a glass cannon, this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember it quite directly. Um, but quite mobile as well. Um, so quite an interesting interesting character. Um, and there's and then, female versions of each of them, isn't yep, there? Yep, yep. It's quite, it's quite nice now that um, in the old Diablo, there's only. Um, they were stuck to single um, single gender per um, per class, but I think even yeah. in I can't remember if Diablo three already opened that up. Um, I think it did. Um, uh, no, it did. Yeah. Different um, different genders for each one, uh, but Diablo two they were still stuck on one specific gender type for each character. Yeah, it was it was kind of a, you know, every class had a specific sex right or gender. Mm. Um, Diablo three um, just kind of up the kind of you know the customization a little bit. Um, and the last one is quite an interesting character. Um, it's, oh. it's a necromancer. Um, it's not really full ranged. It's kind of a in between melee and ranged. Um, it summons skeletons. Um, yeah. Has yeah. a lot of crowd control. Has AOE attacks. Is very versatile actually. Um, it's quite an interesting character. Um, yeah, it's a bit. It's a bit more about summoning though. Mm, I mean, I think mm. they had the um, the witch doctor. Mm -hmm. I think they had the Necromancer and the Witch Doctor, but it looks like they've they've dropped the Witch Doctor in favour of this yeah. class. Lots yeah. of things. Oh, well, they can always add the Witch Doctor on DLC, right? Yeah. So. <laughs> yeah, true, true. But it was yeah. a very similar sort of kind of playstyle, if I remember it correctly. Yeah. yeah. 
Cool. So I'm, I'm drawn. I'm drawn to the wizard and the demon hunter All for right. some reason. Go, well, I think choose one of the two, and then Joe. I think if you choose one of the other, well, whichever one you prefer, and then I'll I'll balance it out. I think because I've already yeah. got an existing character. I think I I don't know. I was I was thinking of doing demon hunter or barbarian. Mm -hmm. I'll go uh, wizard. I'll go wizard then. I think. Oh, cool, cool, cool. Okay, in that case, I'm going to go something like... I might go Crusader then. Go go full-on tank. Or actually, no, I, maybe I'll go the Barbarian then. So, so Joe, I, Joe, I don't mind, actually, if you want to go Barbarian uh, or or Demon Hunter. But it sounds like you guys are going Wizard and Demon Hunter. Uh, no, I'll, I'll go Barbarian, Al. You, right. go de you go Demon Hunter. Uh, depends, you if, that. depends if Jay is going that then. If So if you want to go Barbarian... Uh, Joe, and then Jay, which one do you prefer up the wizard or demon hunter? Uh, I'm gonna go demon hunter then. Demon hunter, alright, cool. In that case, I'm gonna go monk. Because <laughs> okay, it, yeah. it has the most um, buffs for the group. Okay, yeah. So I'll go Indeed. monk. And now we're going to the character creation. This is gonna take us a while just to tweak the um, how it looks. <laughs> oh. Right. Oh, I've never done a female monk. I'll do that one. Hmm. <coughs> so, the, the inventory and management, mm. is, it, is it much the same? Yeah, yeah. Was it? Okay. But the customization looks a little little different, I think. I'm not sure if it's any deeper, but it's, it's well, it certainly looks a lot, you know, a lot slicker. Yeah, music. Music's mm. amazing. <laughs> You've never played... Well, the Diablo games do have great music, and they do go down in, in history. It's like, there's always a... um. A theme as well that they keep dragging around from Diablo 1 all the way through the games, which is really... It just gives you all that nostalgia every time you play these Diablo games. Um, I would say... I, yeah. I see where Destiny's Destiny's ripped the Hunter and <laughs> Warlock. <laughs> mm. Some of the yeah, gear I, looks as well. I think Destiny's ripped off a lot of things. And, uh, I think there's a handful of games maybe you should kind of try. I mean, this is probably one of them. Uh, the other, Borderland as well. Yeah. Um... You know, there's there's a number of things, but this this character creation screen looks a lot slicker, Al. Yeah. I mean, the the Apple Three was just like a a small, if I remember right, the um, you know, a full figure. Well, yeah, like. you've got much more customization in this, which is quite nice, right? So. Yeah. Yeah. Liking this, liking You can preview the gear you get for your class, can't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you can see what it looks like um, on your character, which is quite nice. The, oh really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can see so end game gear. You can do a little bit of a preview um, to see. Um, That's good. If, mm. if I go back and change my hero, can I come back and? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my god! I just want to see what the gear looks like in other ones. Yeah, that's yeah, a yeah. good addition actually. And that's what. That... Well, if you think about a free to play game, the cosmetics at the end is what they want to get you on, really. Yeah, right? yeah, definitely. That's the hook, right? Mm. And uh, with Diablo, um, it's, it's, it's it's always been the customization, the gear yeah. you pick up. Oh my god, it's like I mean, Warlock. I mean, <laughs> the Apple 3, you could pick up some insane armor sets. Just, just insane looking armor sets, you know? Um, so I can understand how they th would think this would really work. Now, I'm at the most difficult bit, which is coming up with a name. This always stumps me for ages. <laughs> oh, yeah. I've been kicked, kicked off a game server. Oh, have you, uh, have you already oh, it's done it? It's connecting back in. No, no, hold on, it's connecting. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. <laughs> You're kicking mm. me off. Regular teething problems. This looks like a Titan from Destiny. <laughs> <laughs> the gear it is cool, yeah. isn't it? Uh, yeah, uh, there's been a lot of effort put into the, um, the gear in Diablo in general, I think. This is why I think when I when I was when I was playing Destiny and I looked at the kind of gear that we were getting in Destiny. I mean the 
the guns themselves were excellent, but like, you know, armor sets and some of the cosmetics you would get in Diablo. Um, it just felt. I mean, I don't know what what Destiny is like these days. It's probably, oh, it's, it's, on probably much in, it's, it's really yeah, good now. Yeah, it's probably it's much great. improved. But at the time, it was you know, it was it was a run below really. Yeah, no, it is. It's on the same level now. I'd say. Oh, it's kicked me off again. <laughs> what are you playing on, Jay? Oh, oh my uh, iPhone 10. Oh. Looks good. Graphics are good. Yeah. So I think the good thing is that you'll also be able to do cross-play. So this character that I've built up to 22 on my Necromancer, I, I started it on the mobile, but then I jumped onto PC. And, you know, if I'm out and about, I can play it on my mobile and can keep the progression going. Mm. Um, so you've so you've already customized your character, have you? Yeah, I've just I've just created it. I've created a name. Um, we'll need to get to level ten and complete the kind of initial stage anyway. So um, it's it's once you've created your character, I think just start progressing the story, and mm. we'll um, we'll keep chatting as we go through it. Um, mm. And as we get to level ten, we can then start to party up. Yeah. Okay. Let's kick me out again. <laughs> Back to the main, unable to connect game server. Yeah, well, welcome to mobile gaming. <laughs> <laughs> right, going back in. I'm hoping my in game audio records. I'm not sure how whether this looks better, worse, or not than Diablo 3 at the it moment. It should look worse, but it mm. depends on what settings you've also put in. Because, mm. um. And it's probably, I would say, it looks more zoomed in than Diablo 3. Yeah, it does. I mean, obviously, the, the level up you just. that just. they just splashed on screen right mm. there, right? Looks totally Diablo. <laughs> you know, free. An but it's got, you know, it's got an actual story to this, and it is—it mm. does fill in a gap, which is quite interesting. So. Mm. Yeah, and I think the good thing is they can just reuse all their assets that they've already kind of produced in, 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 in various other, you know, whether it's Diablo two or Diablo three, or, you know, they may, you know, sneak in some. Diablo 4 type stuff and reuse, reusable content. Yeah, it'd be interesting to see. I mean, because, you know, obviously, I, I I just get my head around where this sits, like when Diablo 4 mm. actually comes out. You know what I mean? Yeah, they don't want this to be too popular because they, they, they still want Diablo 4 to be kind of like um, the main selling one. Well, all, all the PC players are going to leave this. You know, oh, as yeah. soon as Diablo 4 is gone. Yeah, yeah. yeah, but I just wonder what the strategy is behind this. Well, yeah, but grass is good. Level uh, four. Yeah, well, I think they just want to grab some extra money and actually make it more. I don't know. This feels like it's going to be in that in between that casual that casual group. Um, mm. I know the I know the hardcore gamers have already been complaining that this is pay to win, but I think if you play this casually, I think it might be quite nice. Maybe that's yeah. It's an interesting perspective. Mm. I mean, I mean, you might say that. You know, when we when we got to to rifting, mm. right? You know, the the dynamics kind of like I, I don't know about dumbed down, but it was a it was a far more linear experience, if you know what I mean. Yeah. You kind of like you grind out kind of like uh, the season. You get your armor set and you know whatnot. Yeah, yeah. Uh, there's a lot less to think about, but still, it was still quite deep in well, terms I think of. This will also have the the sets thing and the season. I think they're going to do seasons via um, yeah. new maps and stuff. Um, so there's some interesting stuff that they've been doing. When you get when we get to the kind of the world map stuff, you'll see what I suspect their plan is to then reuse a lot of that stuff um, to create yeah. new content as it kind of goes along. Yeah. I mean, I, I was thinking about this, and I was thinking that this could turn into, let's say, you know, the rift system on steroids. Mm, mm. Uh, you know, if you know what I mean, and that might be the hook for this, and that might be the whole point of his existence is really yeah. not to go head to head with Diablo Four, mm. but to really 
this is this is this is this is the seasons. This is the gameplay you get in the seasons in the yeah. in with me. And then keep Diablo One as the kind of key. Um, yeah. Yeah, you know, simpler. How should I say? Well, not simpler. The, the the more kind of standard hardcore Diablo fan. Yeah. The the, the make deep, sure the deep game. Yeah. Really. Make sure Very you close. meet what they need. Yeah. Mm. Come on, can I can I go back later and customize my character again, or, or is it just once only? Um, the customization of your character will. Ooh, you can change class later, which then I suspect you can probably change the customization, and no doubt they'll allow you to do uh, edits later on or all stuff. I've not seen us being able to edit so far, but later mm. on you can change your class, and I think that will allow you yeah. an opportunity. Yeah, Jay. From my own experience, the first character you, you create in Diablo is the first character you're just going to throw away. <laughs> oh, is it? Okay. Yeah. This is your experiment character, so yeah, you can learn the ropes. Okay. Well, th interestingly with this one, Joe, is that, um, th that people say that basically you don't want to be creating too many. You, you want to you try them and see which one you want yeah. to, but then when you invest time, you want to kind of want to stick to one because it allows you to save your it, it allows you to change classes and keep all the progress and all the sort of equipment that you've got um so there's no need to actually have multiple characters how do they keep that balance though Ooh. yes that's i i mean i get i get the yeah. so got any, any tips on any tips on names <laughs> ah this is, is where it gets difficult <laughs> Oh, is it, is it, there's a name generator here. Oh, cool. You can. You can use name generator or, you know, come up with your own. I like this name generator. I, th I think it's, yeah, it's quite an interesting way to go, really. Because mm. I, I mean, one of the most enjoyable things I found with Diablo 3 was the fact that I was always starting a new character. Mm. And not, not only just a new class, but every character um, with a different build. Because the depth of Diablo 3 was basically creating a specific build for a specific yeah. class, and there were so many of them that you could, you know, try and try and basically, you know, uh, create. Mm. So by having like going towards a a single character with you know kind of you know uh, stats that you carry over, that's an interesting take. You know, take, and I guess it's like the whole casual. Kind of like mobile. Yeah, if you've not got enough time to invest in all this stuff, then actually it gives you an opportunity to, you know, just spend time on one and not feel like you're going to get punished. Um, yeah, I'm, I mean, I'm sure even Diablo 3, I'm sure that I basically invested about 500 hours. <laughs> you know, easily. Yeah. Well, I looked at every one of my characters and I had about 20 or 30, you know, not 20 of them to 25 of them. Yeah. And, you know, it was like 70 to 50 to 70 hours played. Probably we're not. I'm actually playing a game. That's probably. <laughs> You're I'm probably, probably a new that. iPhone. Um, mm. Playing a. I need a new iPhone. I think. <laughs> <laughs> How do I do an attack? Oh, there we are. I definitely feel like my Necro was stronger than my mon than the Monk, but maybe I'm playing it wrong. Oops. Oh, I forgot to equip, that's why. <laughs> yes, that's... <laughs> yes, no wonder I wasn't doing enough damage. Mm. Oh, Everything's a lot sl slicker, isn't it? Really, mm. we, we, you'd hope it would be because I mean, Diablo Three is how old, but you know, quite old. Yeah. Comparison. But I, I've got to say, the animation looks, a f you know, a f basically a step up. If I'm kind of, you know, if I'm reading it, you know, right. Yeah, they've well, they definitely made it to. You know, to, it needs to be able to run on a mobile, right? So they've had to do things to tweak it and optimize it. Although mm -hmm. people have also said that the game is not fully optimized for PC yet, so. Um, 
Oh, and I think especially when you get into the busier cities, because it then feels more like an MMO. Because actually, when you're in the open world, there is lots of people. Did you have dungeons and raids? Yeah, 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 yeah. In this game, it has dungeons and raids. Okay. Uh, and... Uh, do you have to coordinate and then, and then like do platforming and that type of stuff, or not? Uh, probably less platforming, but, you know, making sure you dodge the boss's skills or, you know, taking out taking up things that may pop up as part of the fight, I think those will be sort of the mechanics no, that you will have to deal with. Right, got it. Also, ultimately, in the old Diablos, it was just about powering up your your kind of character, whereby none of that was even a factor, hmm. if you know what I mean. Yeah. You basically think I need to give this game a lot of time for it to really make a judgment on that call on it. Um. Well, I think we can already, as soon as we get to level 10 and we can start partying together, we can then do small dungeons as you progress. I think the okay. max level is up to like level 60. And I don't think, I think it kind of starts at um, um, probably like level 50 or so, or 45, I think, as your end game. And you can then start grinding um, dungeons and. Um, uh, <coughs> dungeons and. I don't. Probably not the raids. I can't remember what they call it, but there's like eight player. Um, uh, war bands, I think they call it, um, as groups of things that you can do, which is essentially a raid. Okay, I've just killed some big, big boss thing. Nice. You're probably not too far behind me. I'm a level three now. Nice. <laughs> okay. New skill is available. Tap, tap in inventory. Okay. The cultists are attacking the western gate. We need help holding them back. I can see myself liking this. It's not bad as a little casual yeah, I button can mashing see. hack and slash type game. I, but I think I would want to play on a big screen the last <laughs> thing. <laughs> well, maybe that's the time to invest in a... But, you know, the progress you make on your mobile, you can transfer to your PC. Hmm. When is Diablo 4 coming out? Oh god, that's a very good question. No one really knows. <laughs> no one really never. knows. Yeah, no one really knows. Are we, are we talking like two years away, three years? Ooh. In classic Blizzard style, it it will be ready when it's ready. They 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 take like decades on this thing, so. Right. Like they, they coined the phrase actually. Mm hmm. Hmm. <laughs> but games are limited anyway. If I'm being honest. Yeah. Yeah. The game's early, you reckon? Talk to the guard. Okay, okay. Fully voice acted as well. Yeah. These are games are usually quite high in production value. In my own, I mean, and they're very. I, I think they. Um, they're kind of very, um, let's say, I don't know what, what, what I'd say about it, but it's like, um, they don't cut corners, mostly. Mm, nothing. Yeah, generally the quality the quality value is actually really good. Yeah. Well, apart from stuff like, you know, you know, we've spoken about it on the podcast, but like Warcraft, Warcraft 3, when they did the, re the remaster of Warcraft 3 was horrendous. But oh. things like the Diablo 2 Resurrected refresh, that was really good. And then in general, most Blizzard games are generally high quality. It's World of Warcraft similar style of game, mm, is it? Ooh, actually, there's, there's MMO parts on this, which is quite similar. I would say that if you were to if you were to look on my screen, 
what what I would have is a lot more buttons, a lot more skills. Yeah, I would have basically, yeah. you know, in World of Warcraft, you have like four bars, maybe even eight yeah. bars worth of skills. Um, so your 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 selection of things is much more it's much bigger, and I guess your raids are like then they used to be forty people, but they're now about twenty, I think maybe fifteen um, in terms of number of players in there. Um, so they're just different in terms of the style um, and just much vaster. And I guess the bosses have much more they have they have much more mechanics in terms of what they do. But you know, I I'm it wouldn't surprise me if they've used a lot of you know, World of Warcraft type elements in this game. And there is parts of it that I see in the dungeon system and the raid system where they can, you know, you can create groups automatically off the back of it and stuff. Yep. I'm actually liking this more than I was expecting. <laughs> <laughs> I was actually expecting to come on tonight and think I'll just play something. Bink. Yeah, the whole action RPG games are they, they they strike a really kind of interesting balance. Because they're mostly kind of deep enough for you to get really engrossed in what's going on. Um but there's in, there's enough kind of like um pick and play action that you can just get into it and you can you know, you can while away some time, you know. And just playing with a group of people is fun as well. It's the same with Destiny. They just seem to have nailed the... Just playing with a group, basically. And have becoming more of a social than anything else. Yeah, yeah. The game, the game becomes the backdrop. Well, actually... Is, is the are the worlds and maps big in this game or? Oh, they're big. Yeah, they're big. Okay. And, and is is it is it like um? Will you will you go over the same land again? No, no. So so the levels as you progress and as we progress through the game, there'll be different areas and different worlds that we will traverse through. Right. I'm getting more gear. That feeling of getting gear is. <laughs> Again, that's, that's the a, hook. That's the hook. Yeah. A, 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 anything like, you know, anything with numbers and stats when you're playing. As a, as I was growing up, I just never was drawn to it. <laughs> I was obviously Destiny's been that gateway drug into that. Now I'm I'm hooked. <laughs> In some ways, that's all I've ever known. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I've 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 gone from just pure arcade arcade mechanics and mm. gameplay into something that's a bit more. What do you call it? How do you say it? Um, more intelligence involved in playing. <laughs> Let's put it that way. And, and, and the, the main weapons with each class, can you change them? And Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Think, think of it. It's just not different to playing Destiny and having these exotics. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. There's legendary items and stuff that, that you know. Yeah. I mean, that's where I mean Destiny would have taken it all from these. You know, Diablo was one of these original, um, you know, action RPG types that have been there for many, many years, right? And you know, you'd expect Destiny to have taken ideas from from the likes of you know uh, Diablo uh, as one of the main RPG um, games that are out there. I tell, you what, I, I tell you one thing, it controls pretty well on the, on the, on the mobile phone. They've tweaked the the control system quite well, so... It's yeah, so for impressive. example, you, you know when you press the buttons, mm. so you normally, you've got the joystick on the left, yeah. and then you've got the actual action buttons on the right, mm. when you press down any action button, you can swirl around that button to change the direction. Yeah, you can an angle and actually do a little bit of, you know, if you've got the skill and the time, Angling it, charging it, you can do all sorts of stuff that, that's actually oh, yeah. really, really nice. It, it, it's like the when you press the action button, like a spear or whatever, hmm. it, the, the right the right thumb becomes like a joystick again. Yeah, yeah, you yeah, press yeah. It. It's pretty nice. It's pretty cool. I've never seen that in a game before. Yeah, I mean, there's some of the games that they've taken like, these ideas from, but um, 
But this this is where it's kind of kind of interesting, Jay, because you could also do stuff like you can play this probably on a on a big iPad or something, and it'd be quite nice. Mm. Mm. What you've accomplished is not a lack of scorn. Indeed. On that, we there literally have been quite a few Diablo clones on um, mm. iPhone, iPads, mobiles, yeah. 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 And this is the f first time I've seen, you know, Blizzard. You know, or some, or one of the other, you know, big hitters basically do something like this. Well, Diablo is only going to be on on Xbox, then, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I'll be surprised if they I, bring it to. I, the... you know, I'd be surprised if they limit it like that. But then again, it has to come to PC. If it doesn't come to PC, you know, everyone's going to be up in arms. Darkness is spreading once again, and it seems I must ask the impossible of you. I genuinely feel, you know, there'll be certain things that um, Microsoft will keep to the Xbox console and some other, some other things they just won't bother. Mm. I don't think Diablo has ever been um, like a system seller or a, or a big, um, let's say, reason to get a console. It's a PC game. Yeah. yeah. Ultimately, it's a PC game. But, but I actually, I did play, I think I actually played my first Diablo on PlayStation 1. Diablo 1, I played on PlayStation before I moved to PC. Dude, that was this plays really, really well on the mobile, and I've just seen an article before I started playing on uh, uh, Polygon, I think. They were saying that this game shows that this game was actually built <laughs> for mobile, mm. and it's very well optimized. Yeah. It's just pretty good experience. You know, very good. I'm actually really enjoying it. It's the <laughs> I'm, I haven't played a mobile game for so long, I've just given up on them. <laughs> Jay, before uh, before it gets too deep, make sure you uh, cut your credit card so that you can't spend. <laughs> I'm not spending any money. Else. I don't do that in Destiny either. There's no way I'm doing that. A chance to fight the darkness. To ensure our home. I'm so tempted to in Destiny to buy gear, but I just don't do it. Well, items free. If a shard falls into hell's clutches, our world... Quite a good enemy density as well. Mm. And when we're in a group, it should increase, so that, you know, it, it all kind of stacks up together, which is quite nice. For those without yeah, I've got the character that I like as well. <laughs> here, this portal... Very well. Be cautious on... All right, I think... You can't, you can't fall off the edges, can you? Uh, you can't fall off the edges yet, correct? Yeah. All right, I am in the open world, so when you guys catch up, I can add you to party. And I'm just bang on level 10, so let me sort my skills. Oh, fully charged. Your ultimate skill is fully charged. All right, let's do it now. Oh, wow. What? You not have I'm to level worry. five. Do you not have to worry about potions in this game? Uh, y y Joe, if you look on my screen, there's a little there's a little potion mm. that you stack up. You can basically have three, and mm. it's like a cooldown. Oh, I see, I see. Yeah, yeah. I see, I see. There's also health. There's also health globes as well. Yeah. But is it automatic? No, you've got to click it. So you've got to watch okay. your health bar. But there's no mana mm. now. It's all it's all cooldown based on your skills. Yeah, I see it. Nope. Oh, they're chests we as well. Oh, chests. Yeah. Yeah. Open the codex, right. Oh. Hmm. Equip two magic items. Oops, I must have items. Aha! Oh, what the heck? I just died. Oh. <laughs> Press Q to use health potion. Thank you for that tip. <laughs> <laughs> Annoyingly, a bit too late. I was bit, looking for that. A bit too late. <laughs> yeah. I want to go salvage some of that stuff. It doesn't show you if the... So how do you, Steve, compare the gear that you picked up with the one that you've already got? Um, 
when you are in your inventory, um, there's normally normally ones of improvement have a little green arrow upwards. But yeah. what you can do is, if you select the gear, it should then compare, I think, between your current versus your um, versus the new item. Oh, right, okay. I just realised that Necromancer's got two different weapons on each hand. It's got a shield, typically one shield, and then a and then a, 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 a wand or a or a dagger type. Yeah. Uh, will I will I die if I go into the inventory then? It, yeah, the game that, doesn't yeah. the game doesn't pause, so you need to be careful where you're kind yeah, of rummaging same. your inventory. Yes, yeah, same as Destiny. Yeah. I'm liking this monk actually. I'm actually preferring it over my Necro. Is I mean, this game is better than I thought it would be. Actually, it's not. It's not as bad as it. You know, as people. Mm. I mean, I, I think the problem is that a load of people have rushed to the end game, and now they're they're competing for like you know, mm. PvP or the top the top immortal tag. Uh, for rifts and stuff, and and the only way you can compete in that is you probably are going to have to spend. But, yeah. but honestly, if you're casually playing and casually playing with friends, I don't see why you would need to, unless you want to show off some nice cosmetics or something. God, it's bit, it, like even in this town, it's really busy. There's loads of it, loads of people. feels like an MMO. That you know, the number of characters I'm seeing the number of player characters I'm seeing here. Up in here. It makes you feel like an MMO. Mm. Oh he's got his energy back. Start to chug a little bit on my phone. <laughs> <laughs> well, once phone you, is cold. I think once you get into a very highly populated area of lots of people, then you'll definitely feel it. And then we'll come back. Level six. Nice. Once you get to about ten, um, you'll be able to get to. Um, um, uh, well, we'll be able to party. Um, let me actually. Let me keep going a bit. I can always come back to to where you guys are. Is that a chest or a stash? It's a stash. Oh, um. Oh, no, you know, I was just thinking, because you're not playing on them. Um, if you're playing on PC, there's a little trick that you could do for ranged characters, but. So you get your blacksmith like all the other games. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> me. Destiny's got lots of portals in it now. <laughs> right, I'm in the town bit area now. Yeah. So familiar. Huh? <laughs> Talk 
to the blacksmith. Waiting to salvage. I have my reach. Yeah, I couldn't, couldn't hear you there, Joe. Well, Sacred Cain is back from the dead, hey? <laughs> well, mm. it's back in the... So, don't forget, this is between 2 and 3. Mm. So, he's so. technically not... Um, mm. He's not died yet. <laughs> mm. Spoiler alert. <laughs> yeah. No, it's been years now. <laughs> I can't believe it, no. Can't call spoiler alert now. <laughs> no, not really. Yeah. It is very zoomed in, isn't it? Mm. Could do with being a bit further out. I don't know if the controls are as responsive as, like, maybe, um, the third game. What Diablo three? Yeah. No, it's definitely not. I don't. Yeah, I don't think it's. Again, this is why I think um, people have already noticed it's not as fully optimized. Yeah. No. Um, Stop wasting my time, you peasant. I know. Is it? This is the game where it completely Wrong flopped at the conference, and they the got. Uh, uh, Blizzard employees got abused. Is this the one? Yeah, 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 this is the one. So three years ago, when they announced this, everyone was expecting Diablo 4. Yeah. And then, obviously, basically, that one guy basically asked, you know, is, you know, is there any intent to bring this to PC? And there was, at that at that moment in time, he said no. And then everyone was just basically booing, and he came up with yeah, the point, which, which is, you know, have you not all got phones? <laughs> yeah. <was> just like... <laughs> right, and it's a dumb thing to say, wasn't it, really? Yeah. yeah. Is that guy still there? Yeah, yeah he's um, he's still the lead um, lead designer, lead uh, lead game designer. Right. So that that's when they made it a PC version as well. Yeah. Well, the thing was, I think he 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 basically what he was what what he really needed to say was the fact that he'd already discussed it. But there wasn't any funding to go and do it because they weren't, you know, the, probably the supporters of it weren't that interested. But he'd already s probably had the idea of having it on PC, but he yeah. just never actually, you know, committed to delivering it on PC. But as you can see right now, I am playing on PC and it's cross on, you know, cross save, cross progression onto mobile, which is really, really handy. And it's probably one of the main reasons Genshin is so popular, is because you can play it on both. Mm. Mm. This conceivably started as some sort of expansion to Apple Free. Mm. You know, like.
Yeah, and it doesn't surprise me if they use, you know, they've definitely reused a lot of the assets because the characters yeah. are, you know, the classes are from there, right? So. The hell is that thing? Oh, there's a gravestone? The hell? Someone's doing PvP here. Good. <laughs> what was? They do have good actors. Oh, Mostly, are the <clears throat> Blizzard games are extremely polished. So, yeah, are the footprints always there in play? You can disable it if um, for quest. Uh, basically, it's there to guide you on the quest um, navigation. Yeah, thing. but you can say. Yeah, it's just signposting, isn't it, really? Okay. You can't damage your your foes, can you? You can't damage your what? Your your, your friends. Uh, don't think so. I don't think there's any friendly fire. But there is a yeah, there is yeah. PVP in this game, so you um. Oh, okay. uh, I don't think it's enabled by default. Okay, nice. Nice. I'm on level. I'm on level seven now. Cool. You're almost there. How's your download going, Joe? I'm on level eight, mate. <laughs> <laughs> Are you really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I stopped downloading quite a while back. Okay. That's cool. I'm just admiring the sights. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it literally does feel like I'm just playing Diablo 3 mm. in certain so, certain ways. Are, are you bored of Diablo 3? Because given it's been out for so long, uh, I don't know. Actually, I haven't played it in a while. But it's um, it's a it's a weird game loop you have in that thing. It's just about the builds. So you know, if there was a new build to chase, I would basically not be that bored. Um, okay. but you know, the the actual mechanics are very similar the the thing that saves it is probably inventory and you know picking up you know certain items going through season trying to get a new armor set you know it's that sort of thing really what I do for you? All right. job well done. What can I, do I was you? I was just Let admiring everything and slowing down thinking you're behind me but I'm behind you now <laughs> <laughs> There is always more to understand. In many ways, I, I, I shouldn't really have enjoyed Diablo Freedom as much as I did. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's, you know, because really, it really is a, it is a it, it's almost a spreadsheet game. I literally have got a spreadsheet <laughs> for it. It's... What can I do for you? What well. can I do for you? But no, the, the builds, you know, you can do do some amazing things with them. The power ups you can get for them, pretty amazing. Yeah, that's, that's, I was just saying to uh, Al as well that the, the latest Destiny scenes and a lot, even the last year, it's really leaning into build crafting mm. to another level. As in, they've, they've got all of all of the cost to to swap your mods and stuff, and they they come out with mods, gear mods, and um, every uh, season. Sandbox mods, gear like uh, armor gear mods, weapon gear mods, but like, just adding more and more and more. <laughs> I 
Oh, the enemies are changing a little bit. Reasonably well off to my for my iPhone ten. Hmm. Let me up my gear. Got blue armor. Finish. Strength, intelligence, fortitude, vitality, and willpower. Okay. Cosmetic resources are missing. Would you like to download now? What's Cosmetic that? Cosmetic resources are missing. It could just be the um. It could be the uh, certain um. Uh, character cosmetics, like so some bits you need to download. Um, oh, there's loads of these download things. Yeah. Yeah. But you can do that afterwards as well. It depends on how far through the game you get. So, I think it wants to just pre-download it because um. Um, Pre-download it so that it doesn't have to do it later. Ooh, another blue one. Yeah. Jesus. Are they hid are they hid hidden chests and stuff or? Nice. Uh, are there hidden chests? I've not seen any, but I think there are some hidden sections. There's like hidden okay. dungeons and stuff as well. Oh, that's probably a pretty good farming space. I guess that's why those guys are hanging around there. I'm level 8. Nice. Struggling now, lagging. <laughs> the lagging quite badly. in the monk's mobility. And quite a lot of gold. have nearly overrun her home. That cannot be good. Finally, a little light. I'm too late. Oh, ow. How do I, how do I basically join you? Oh, are you, are you now level 10? Yeah, I'm level right, 10. Give me a moment, I will add you. Following you, stranger. So, you'll see an invite in a moment. Uh, hopefully that's... Oh, wait a second. That player has not unlocked, I think. Is this? 
Did you get the invite? I don't know. Let me try that again. Oh, I'm showing us a tick. I didn't kill. It might mean it might need you just to get into the town section. Yeah, fair point actually. I'm on my way. Let's see. Rathna, it's a oh, girl. So once you've completed that boss and finished talking to to Deckard, it should once you're in the town you'll see lots of people. In fact I can teleport to it now, so I can find you. Um Let me know once you... Let me see if I can add you now. I think you're a work. Player hasn't unlocked the feature as yet. What? Uh, I wonder... Yeah, I mean, it shows you're in Wyrvan, but... Um, Still talking to Deckard. Ah, okay, okay, okay. That's probably why. Mm. It's good to see you well. Cool. Just on this boss, I think. Yeah, once you've done that boss and finished the bits with you put that to good Deckard use, Kane, right? I can then add you guys. Although Jay, oh, hold on. To... I, spoke, I spoke too soon. There's another boss. <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> Move quicker. Oh, don't die now. Don't forget your potions. Oh, yeah. I've done, I've done him. Nice. Get this, get this loot. 
Crap, 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 crap. Yeah, even if I was playing on an iPhone, like a Mac or something, the bigger screen would be a difference. Mm. The levels all look kind of similar, dark like this, do they? Uh, uh, they can be different, and actually, you can change the. If you go into graphical settings, you can you can up the um, the the color mood. As well. Oh well. Right. Okay. There's actually quite actually for a mobile game. There's a lot of customization that you can do to the graphics, which is very shocking. Yeah. Um, I'm level ten and back in the Sweet. town. Uh, when, once talk. you've finished talking to Decker, then come out to the main town. You should start to see a load of a load of people. Once you see a load of people, I can invite you to the group. Yeah. Cool. Are you trying to send me another invite now? Oh, uh, let me do that now. Invite sent. All done here, all use. Okay. Okay. My strength is yours. I can't even see you on the map. Where are you? I'm coming. I see I what see. you mean. Oh, hello. <laughs> there you go. Mingo with you mean the bees here. Warm. <laughs> that's why, that's why I said remove all your cases and everything, because it gets... Uh... <laughs> but that might also be a good time for us to pause and... Uh, um... Yeah, point, snacks. actually. Yeah. Some snacks. Mm. Actually, Jay, yeah. Yeah. I probably need to add you to... Um... To my back, uh, or uh, I, I don't know if I could add you to in game friends actually. I wonder. I need a couple of minutes, I'm just doing something. Wait, I don't know. Right. The reality is, is this this does look like a, a slightly more polished, I don't necessarily mean from graphical fidelity, but just the way things are laid out in, you know. Some of the um, the two D images, hmm. and uh, but the game's pretty much the same, hmm. really. The reality, right? Uh, it's it's not bad. Hmm. Uh, let me check. Let me grab my phone and see how I how I add people in Diablo Immortal. Is this Are we gonna do it? Sorry, guys. Is this a beta? Still, it is, isn't it? The PC one technically is a beta. Mm. Yeah, I noticed it was on your menu, on the main menu, and I, but it's not on the uh, actual phone. Mm. Yeah, I think the yeah, I think the uh, mobile one's the full one. Um, yeah, we're still in beta mode on this. Are we going to play? Uh, I'm going to take you to Destiny one day. <laughs> I think we wanted to do it over Christmas last time because it's technically with um, the crossplay now. Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah it is. Yes. So. 
Really? Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What would we need to play together? Would I need the latest expansion or? Uh, I'm not for, for sure how far back the free to play goes. Actually, yeah. Oh, it was a free, oh yeah, but yeah, of course, yeah. There's a free to play element. I'm pretty sure you could probably do some of the latest stuff, but oh. but the dungeons and raids you wouldn't be able. To, you would have to level up as well. So. Yeah. Oh, I need to. I think I. Jay, I need to add you to to battle net. It's the only way I think. Mm. Okay. Um, you may Ooh. need to go onto your battle net. Um. Uh, on a web browser or something, or I don't know. Actually, there is. I think there's a Battle.net um, mobile app that you can probably run your account from there, and then I can add you from it. Mm. I, I think I've sent you a friend invite for, to it anyway. I think based on what you were, we were covering earlier. Right. So, so excuse me a minute. Sorry. Yeah. So if you boot up like a Battle.net app, and then I can add you. Mm. Warframe isn't is in crossplay yet, is it? Warframe, I do not think so. Because mm. it was always always about the cross save cross progression, and something mm. like that is so powerful because you can play on any any device you want, anywhere you want, sort of thing, right? So yeah, I'd be surprised if it didn't go that route sooner or later. Yeah, so in April twenty two, uh, April twenty twenty two, they still hadn't got cross play. Mm. Uh, let's see if cross cross save. Uh, will Warframe ever have? So it was announced in June 21. Mm. And it's supposed to be this year. So it's supposed to be this year that they that they have it. But I don't know if COVID has caused them delays and stuff. Well, they're still bringing out the content now. <laughs> so it must have, it's a question of priority, isn't it? So Yeah, but... But Warframe, I think they need to evolve, right? Because they're falling behind all these um, all these other games, right? So they need to think about um, what else can they do? Is there going to be a, is there a mobile version of Warframe? Can they even make it work on mobile? It's a Switch version of Warframe. Mm -hmm. That's as far as I've taken it, I think. I don't know about mobile necessarily, but I think just to, you know, cross-play, you know, pick it up from whatever kind of platform you're kind of running on would mm. be good. Because the reality was, I mean, the PC version of Warframe versus the console one, you know, in terms of the in terms of the actual game, wasn't really that much different. Wasn't it? It wasn't different at all. If I'm being honest. Yeah. You've been able. You've been able to add uh, to Jay. No, I need, um, I need them on the Battle.net friends first. I think. Right. Mm. So I'm. I'm, I'm Walking outside, and it's reconnecting. If you're walking Connection outside, failed. I can't see you. No, it's, it's just gone. Re after, it's just disconnected me. <laughs> it's because there's too many characters outside. Look, look how busy it is. Joe, Joe look how busy it is yeah. in this town. It's crazy. I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Being un un unable to connect to the server. <laughs> oh, shit. Is this isn't this sightless? Isn't that your server? Or? Yeah, sightless, sightless eye. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, Joe, do you know you can use the WASD keys as well to move? Oh yeah, I know. It's quite, I kind it's quite, of did it's quite it. Nice. Yeah, I did it while I was playing the on, against the boss. I realised I cheat. <laughs> 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 this is the easiest way to deal with him. <laughs> well done, hero. You've saved. Well, I'm gonna be. Uh, I'm gonna grab, grab myself another beer or something. Give me a sec. Yeah. Oh, here we go, people. It's people. You must. You must. You. You're gonna see us outside. I think. Depends on what your name is. 
Yeah, there I am. Javine. Oh, oh hello. Hello, hello. Uh, the problem is, I need you on Battle.net, I think. That's the only way I can add you, I think. Oh, no, no, hang on. Got you. Here we are. Uh, Our fates become Yay! Oh, yay! There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Success. <laughs> nice. Yeah, this is right. uh, this is crossplay mobile to PC. <laughs> That's crazy, yeah. Uh, I'm just going to get some snacks as well, some yeah, junk. Yeah. Let's, uh, I'm going to grab a quick beer as well. Uh, and top oh. of water. Uh, let's quick break. Cool. I do actually want to play the barb at some point just to try out the uh, the skills and stuff. you are back, I think I might have to promote you one of you to leader so that we complete your quests, I think. I'm not really sure how I feel about this whole removing of the mana thing. Removing of the mana? Yeah, mm -hmm. it's strange, right? In comparison to, obviously, other... Every other Diablo game has, has almost had, you know, has had that mana bar. And mana yeah, potions, it, right? Yeah, I mean, there's, there's a whole raft of clones that have followed the same formula. Mm. For one thing. But what's... I mean, they've also just decided to have cooldowns. It yeah. simplifies everything. Um... But you used to be able to create those builds where you'd basically just keep stacking them, you know, <laughs> the amount of mana you'd produce, if you know what I mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mana regen of, builds and mana yeah. shield builds, yeah, yeah. And you kind of just basically removing a whole, you know, slew of kind of like, um, let's say, 
gameplay almost. Yeah, I, I can't imagine they would... Well, so this is where it'll be interesting. I can't imagine they'll do it to Diablo 4. No, because, I can't. Because, it, because it's so iconic to the Diablo, you know, kind of gameplay. I can't imagine they would do it. But... It would really have some backlash if they do. Yeah, I mean, Immortal sets a precedence, right? But mm. it doesn't mean that they would have to definitely follow that. Mm. Yeah, it's interesting. I do see why they've done what they've done. I mean, it's it's mostly because, of, you know, this is a most, mostly a simplified version of the mm. actual full Di Diablo experience that comes as, you know, practically as close as you're going to get on a, on a mobile, I'm sure. Mm. Looks like Jay dropped. <laughs> mm. Hey guys. Hello, hello. I'm sitting in a complete dark oh. in my office. Oh no, <laughs> is that a power cut? Oh, no, 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 as in... You just knocked uh, the lights on. <laughs> yeah, just enjoying the game with the lights off. Hmm. Okay. Uh, oh, that is a l lovely bit of lag. I think you've... Well, oh, you've just reconnected. Uh, let me re-add you. Okay. You guys ready to go, or you want a bit more time for a break? I'm ready to rock and roll. Yeah, I can go. Alright, uh, I'm going to promote uh, Joe, you to leader. I'm mm. worried that um, if I'm the leader, it tries to complete my quests, and I've already completed a load of them. So if I make mm. you leader, I think it, we can complete your quests. Okay, so what should I do now? Do I just follow the map? Yeah, if, I think if you select the quest, we can just follow you. Alright. So we should it's just this. complete it together. So... That... Um, should just be down over this way, but... Hmm. It's this. Okay, yes, yeah, so I'll just... Nope. Yeah. Should be this way, I think. We should actually be moving to a new area, if I remember correctly. That was quick. And then, we're, and it, once we're out of the town, it should be less laggy. So. <laughs> mm. Yeah, just too new. Oh. <laughs> I think oh. it's, I think it's up this way. But give me a second, one, one second. I put this. Open this codex to view the guide. What's this? Right, come. <laughs> and who is this person in front of us? Oh, just some random. This is this is the MMO aspect. They're literally just people dotted all over the server. Mm. So we should be going into a new area. Okay. All these familiar areas. <laughs> Have you been to these areas before? They're quite similar in nature in terms of the other Diablo games, that's all. Um, I, I mean, I've already done this um, previously, but... Uh, Joe, we probably need to wait for Jay a tiny bit. Oh, okay. Where is he? He's loading slightly. Um, oh, okay. Oh, 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 I'm in, I'm in. Just wait a second, I'm coming. <laughs> mm. Save some enemies for me. <laughs> we should be sharing EXP anyway. Alright, Joe. Yeah. Joe, lead the way, whichever way it's supposed to be. Do you mind if I mess around in my inventory just very quickly? Yeah, so yeah. you probably picked up some items. Yeah, I have. Uh... Yeah, what the bloody hell does this mean? Uh... I'm level 11. Whee! <laughs> <laughs> Equip that. Equip this. Um, no. Right, that's gonna get equipped. 
I have to put some crisps. <laughs> I'll put it on mute. No, I eat. Oh. Um, have either of you got a uh, hard cut off at all? Uh, I'm probably not going to stay for too long. Yeah, should we should we say another ten minutes if you want to go yeah. for half past or something? Yeah. Yeah, I think we should be able to get to some you know some bits um, by that point. I think you need to speak to someone around here and then you're good. Hmm. Oh, the other thing to pay attention to is the in your um in the mini map. Um sometimes there'll be um like special characters and the chests and stuff and other things will show up as well. So mm. you'll see bosses and um kind of like higher level creeps, uh, higher level mobs that kind of pop up as blue blue color and gold color. Um, that you want to okay. keep an eye out for. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's cool. I've noticed that this thing isn't as destruct. You know, it's on the uh... the environment. Yeah. Uh, there, there is. Um, you could still, um, you can still hit it by holding shift. Yeah. So like, uh. um, so some bits will be like these, these, these sort of gravestones. They'll, they'll break. Oh. Yeah, in the combat, my it's lagging quite a lot. <laughs> when there's probably two of us hitting stuff as well at the same time, I think that's probably mm. not helping you. Yeah. Oh, there's a blue, blue, blue mobs, blue mobs, blue mobs on the bottom right. Oh, I see it. Yeah. Wow, I am. Uh, this is literally four frames a second I'm getting. Oh no. Through hardship, we kill them. Oh, there you are. Get a cutscene in this bit. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure I can help you on this bit, but mm -hmm. we'll wait and see. I'm assuming you guys are still in the cutscene. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. Right. Oh, I can help you with this bit. Just wondering if we managed to complete it for Jay there, because mm. it might have been too quick. <laughs> oh dear. Did you, uh, Jay? Do you know if you if your quest is completed? I'm speaking to the guy on the bridge. 
okay. Maybe I think that's okay. I think that's okay. Yeah, if he thanks us, then I think we're we're okay. Hmm. Hmm. Don't. Should ah. lead us backwards, I think. Right. Head to guards watch. Joe's uh, behind us now. Mm. <laughs> I'm going down to like tower five. Is, is it really lagging? <laughs> Mm. It's, it's, it's some moments, yeah. I think as soon as we do do kind of moves and stuff, I suspect it kind of causes it to go. But maybe it's worth just like bringing down the settings in your um, in your graphics. That might help. So. Or some of the effects. I think maybe from um, um, that might that might help. Yeah. Uh, give me a second. Uh. Settings. Wow, it's really deep controls, isn't it? Yeah, uh, there's a lot of customization you can do. For graphics. Mobile. Yeah. Frame rate's at 30. Yeah. Resolution medium. It's on high. Try, yeah, try bringing it down and see if that helps at all. Nice. Uh, if you look on the map, we're behind you. Image oh, accuracy. My. Sorry, image accuracy was high. Spread to medium. Yeah, yeah. Just, I mean, just try tweaking them down and see if it doesn't screw up your graphics too much. Selection. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, it looks more blurry but smoother. Yeah. Well, see how it see how it copes. Um, Oh. <laughs> Who this guy? Uh, let's just wait for uh, Jay for a sec. <laughs> Well, sure, but I, I think I would have been happy happier if they just basically um, integrated some of this into some sort of expansion, and if they wanted to roll it out on mobile as well. Yeah, actually, exactly right. So what they could have done, mm. but maybe maybe they also wanted the fact that they had a separate developer do this, right? So I think that may have been the uh, problem is that they wanted to separate out some of the issues they probably had with Diablo Three. Uh, but but like you say, they could have easily have well depending on if the game engine even worked, whether they could have had a, a mobile expansion or something. And then, you know, yeah. reused... Could, could you imagine that reusing all your Diablo 3 characters and stuff? That would be quite that'd be quite good fun. Would've I would been, actually quite enjoy it. That would have been amazing, mm. you know. Do you say they got an extra character class here? The, well, so, so what happened was they the Witch Doctor got replaced by the Necro in this one. And the Necro yeah. was... Um, Necro was an expansion character, DLC character, I think. Yeah, yeah, I've got it. Yeah. So, so I think the Witch Doctor is the only one missing, but I'm expecting that to be the DLC one. Mm. My oh. frame rate seems to be better now. Oh, cool. Um, let's see how we do. When we, uh, so, there's a town coming up, so maybe we stop in the town when we when we just clear mm. this, this bit. 
Um, and there's a there's quite a bit of fighting on this bit, so let's see if that okay. uh, that that holds up. Definitely much better. That's good. It's still slowing down a little bit, but mm. more playable. Those. Is that it? If you're done, you can come into town. Alright, and there's just a, a few talking quests here. Um, and then you should be able to get... You, you should get a, a good item, actually. You? So, um, what can I do for you? A job well done. Interesting. He'll um, talk to Paulie. Where's Paulie? That's the blacksmith in the corner. Yeah, yeah. Once you've done that, um, that should give you an item, and then we're. I think we're probably good to leave it here, I think. Yeah, I think so. Actually. Uh, these, items, these items that haven't got any green up arrows, I can salvage all of them, can't I? Uh, yes. Is to, well, actually, just make sure you save one, uh, because I think there's some quests that you can complete in the moment um, uh, once you've unlocked these bits. And then actually one 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 quest will basically say to um, to do um, a salvage an item. So, so you can salvage, but just save one item at least. Yeah, okay. Oh, they change the gear first. Oh my god, the chat channel is uh... a <laughs> mm. god. What? Uh, it's, it's classic uh, MMO style um, uh, mm. world chat. <laughs> mm. Mm. Yeah, have you played? Uh, um, what is that other kind of action RPG? That, that Amazon published. Oh, Lost Ark? Yeah, Lost Ark. I did play a bit of it. My brother's playing it a lot. Yeah. And he's sunk good? all his time into it. Uh, it's another one of those that's quite interesting where people talk about it being pay to pay to win. Mm. But I, I think I think the thing the good thing about Lost Ark is that actually if you play a class like the the wizard or the sorceress in there, it actually feels really epic in terms of the spell casting. And basically you just kill lots and lots and lots of mobs. And, yeah. and your and your attacks feel really impactful. Mm. So it's really nice. What they really need is if they had something that also allowed you to do stuff on mobile as well, and it would be that it would have probably hooked me in. But I could see how much time investment was needed and the MMO aspects of it, and I was like, nah, I um, don't want to sink myself into it. Um, mm. It's probably worth a try. I mean, we can we can give it a go now that the servers are stable as well. Maybe that's what we do on the next one. Yeah, although, it might be interesting to kind of have a look at this. Yeah, although you know, Jay, like... Jay, I don't think has a setup for it either, though. So, have you got yeah. you got gaming? Have you got a gaming PC or anything? No, I don't. Unfortunately, mm. no. I've got an Xbox. Yeah, well, you know, you're not going to be playing anything on that anytime soon. So. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that, that has to basically stay in stasis for, for about half a year, I think. It, it really needs, right? And I think we talked about it in the past in the podcast. Yeah. If they had stuff like you could play your Steam library on it, that would just be insane. Mm. And Lost I, Ark I is doubt, I doubt, I doubt Val would ever allow it. <laughs> you know, yeah. I doubt they would ever allow that. Yeah. How do I save? Uh, well, it's it's constant save, so your character is oh, automatically okay. saved. So we will, when you exit, you will be here. And mm. one thing you want to do is, if you look at your, I think it's the codex. Um, mm. Make sure you start clicking through your battle pass quests. And one other thing is, if you go to the menu in the top right, 
and you yeah. go to mm. events. Is it events? No, it's not events. It's um, first kill of the day. You should already have the a free item for today. Oh yeah. Hmm. What's that called? The uh, events. Is yeah, it? events. So if you go to the top right and then the bottom, sorry, the bottom left, then once you've clicked the once you click menu, um, on the top right, there's a bottom on the very bottom left underneath events. It says first kill of the day, and you basically can get rewards for almost logging hmm. in every day just for just to kill one single thing. I see. So you probably want to collect those things, and then you know if you log on tomorrow to kill something, you can continue the um, mm. continue the rewards. Mm. Cool. Um, I guess we're done. I think so. I mean, it's an interesting kind of version of the app, I think. Mm. Not that about that, it's. Um... I I really enjoyed that. <laughs> I don't know what it is like. <laughs> I I I I think I can I can get into this. Mm. Yeah, I mean, well, welcome to the world of uh, Diablo. You yeah, know, cheers, Jay. Thank you. Yeah. So, oh, oh, so are we going to play again next next week? Or uh, yeah, we can build a schedule around this, maybe, or we can try something yeah. else. Or, or I, I think yeah. for this, right? I mean, like we, we'll, you know, we yeah, maybe we can play together, but outside of basically maybe kind of um, streaming or kind of recording it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. May, maybe. Um... You might. Do you mind if we give it a go for a couple of weeks and just just see? No, how no, I don't, I, I don't mind. You know, like uh, mm. I might nice even game to play together, isn't it? Just... Yeah, I might even go back to kind of Diablo three to see how it compares after this. <laughs> you know? Just to remind yourself. Yeah, I'm actually quite curious now, but there's there's all mm. sorts of things that I could. I'm thinking of this is going to be a catalyst for like like um. Path of Exile. I wanted to play. Oh yeah, Poe, was... Poe, and Poe Two. When that comes. Yeah, out, I and um, obviously Lost Ark. Mm. Yeah. You know? So it's just a, a good way to kind of um, have. Is a Lost Ark a similar type of game? Yeah, they're all, but they're both similar. I would Path say Exile Lost Ark is bigger and there's more. It it you need a good machine because it drains drains the hell out of your PC. Um, yeah. But it's um, yeah, it's an interesting, it's an interesting kind of like game. This hmm. I'm still not sure how I feel about it. It's just you know I I've, I enjoyed it, but I enjoyed it because it reminds me of Diablo. <laughs> you know like uh, hmm. so I'm I'm wondering if I went back to Diablo three and kind of like play Diablo three, would I what would I prefer? Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? It's an uh, interesting one because Diablo three is definitely is definitely deeper. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah. What's uh? So why are people just playing this then? Because it's just new. Yeah, it's just new. It's new. It's free to play. It's something to something to play around with, and the mobile aspect. I think. Mm. But, right. I mean, if you if you if you play, if you play Diablo three, I mean, I think in terms of the look and feel of the game, it pretty much identical. Yeah, um, and I would say the skills, the skills that I've got on my monk is pretty much the same skills that you get yeah, as a yeah. monk. Definitely, the whirlwind I'm mm. basically kind of doing, you know, pretty much the same. Yeah, I think I, so when when Diablo 4 comes out, we can definitely play that more seriously, can we? Yeah, that is it, should is, 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 be is, on is, is game, as well. Yeah. Is that a game you can play that like once a week? It's like a hobby type thing, is it? Ooh, yeah, a, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah, that is definitely, once once you get into the end game, Mm. Um, if they've got a decent end game, yeah, you you pretty much, you you know, you pretty much basically it's a time sink, effectively like, like Destiny, basically. <laughs> yeah, effectively like. I, Destiny. I, know, I keep talking about Destiny. Sorry, guys. I just it's just a <laughs> good it's a good reference for me to understand. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's pretty much like that. But it's a, it's a it's a total time sink. Um, but if they kept basically to what Diablo three does well, then it's all about your builds. The end game is like is about your builds, but and that's all it is. Um, and and the raids are they like as in like we sweat your balls off for like an hour trying to get a boss? I I, th I think for Diablo three it wasn't about raids, was it? Out it's no, about these it's uh, rifts, things called rifts. Rifts. It was all rifts. rifts. And yeah. the, good, the, good, the interesting thing about Diablo three was you could just basically self grind. Mm. Paragon levels and just keep grinding as hard as you can to to go mm. deeper and deeper into these rifts. 
Th mm. I think there's a similar system in this game, but I think the party and the raid aspects are actually quite important as well. Yeah. And again, I've I've not got to the end game in this game, so I I'm not you know I've not seen it yet. Yeah. The yeah. The, the rifts Jay were all about literally building your car your different builds. Mm, right. Effectively, that was the, always the outcome. Yeah. You, know, you go through a season and you get these really exotic armor sets. And, you know, your character would be able to, you know, you give it extra capabilities, it's, you know, um, all of that sort of thing. So that that was your kind of like, you know, your, that was the the, the thing you were kind of like playing for, almost. It was yeah. less about, there, was, there wasn't, I don't think there was a concept of what I'd call, you know, raids, as we, as you know them. Mm. Well, it definitely didn't exist, right? I mean, the best you could do no. was, you could group together to do riffs. Which mm. was what parties of three, I think it was. It wasn't even four. Yeah, um, it was, it's always free. Yeah, it was. You're right. It was free. Yeah, and even here you could see where you know we can have a party of four, but the mm. war, the the war gang, I think is supposed to be eight, mm. which is a raid. I think a a aspect in this game, which I think is then closer to what Lost Ark is. I think Lost Ark raids go up to. Oh God, I think it goes up to ten, maybe fifteen. Um, That's quite substantial. Yeah, let me just double check that. Actually, um, I know my brother's been playing a lot of the kind of difficult raids. Mm. Um, there are so many good overhead action RPG games now. Mm. This, I mean, this other one that I've kind of started playing was um, what's it? Uh, Warhammer, um, Inquisitor, M Martyr. Um, pretty much the same sort of style of game based in the Warhammer universe. Um, by the same folks who did uh, Van Helsing, um, so it has a certain kind of like style to it. Yeah. Oh, uh, so Lost Ark is actually just eight, eight as well. So it's actually the same as this. It's four and eight. Hmm. Which is interesting. Yeah, that is interesting. There's a lot of Russian in the in the actual text, <laughs> isn't there? <laughs> well, that's just people chatting. That's people chatting away. Mm. Um, I mean, Path of Exile would be the other one to maybe tr try and play. Because mm. I'm actually very interested in that. Um, Have you ever played um, uh, Dungeon Fighter? You heard of that? What, what is that? What was that? It's, it's Dungeon Fighter Online. It's, it's a Korean game. Mm, don't Not heard so. of it. Never heard of it. Okay. The only reason I mention it is because there's a there's an Ark System Reserve fighting game coming out in this yeah, month. Yeah, maybe maybe you're saying actually. Yeah, and it's based on that franchise, so mm. it's a Korean game, so it makes me quite popular. Yeah. Well, well, Lost Ark started off as a it's a Korean game, so it's um it's still very grindy in that in that style. But interestingly, Amazon took it to uh, to be published here, which is. Mm. Mm. Which is interesting, you know. It's got it's got pretty. It's been relatively successful, but I think people have have got into that grind, that late game grind mechanic, and the it's a similar sort of pay to win aspect that people are saying like, nah, maybe not. Um, but I think that's where you know a lot of games are getting stuck. Yeah, uh, guys, I'm I'm, I'm going to yeah. I'm going to go because I've got a oh, wedding to go to tomorrow. Yeah, uh, not, cool, cool, not, cool. not in the morning. A wedding, a wedding reception, sorry, in the afternoon. So. Yeah, let's call it quits and I'll... Uh, yeah, well, let's call it, let's call it. Yeah, definitely okay. interested in giving it a couple of weeks on this. Though. Yeah, cool. yeah nice definitely in interesting. Okay, guys, All I'll, right. I'll speak, speak soon. Yeah, cool, take cool. care, guys. Bye. Take it easy. Right. Bye.